How's it going, everybody? Uh, this is Trainer Connor, and we are here with a Wi-Fi Bell video. If you enjoy this Wi-Fi Bell video, make sure you like this video and subscribe for more content. But this these series of videos I will be posting uh, for the next few days here are going to be battles on the Johto Classic Wi-Fi competition which is very similar to the um, Kanto Classic competition that I posted a few battles on a little while ago. So if you have not seen those battles, make sure you hit those up. But for this competition, we're eligible not only the original 151 Pokemon, but you're also eligible of using um, second generation Pokemon. So you've got a lot more variety in terms of what Pokemon you can use for this competition, which is great. Um, for my team, I brought Arcanine, I brought Venusaur, Clefable, Quagsire, Dragonite, and Raikou. So, not a bad team overall. Uh, these are Pokemon that were going to be the top used Pokemon in a uh, forum that I was looking at before the competition began. I'm like, you know what, let's just go ahead and pick those Pokemon because they're going to be used a lot anyway. So, all right, this is the first battle here. Um, of course, the other ones will be posted later on a later date. Um, I'm bringing Arcanine, Venusaur and Dragonite to this battle. And of course, my opponent here is using Azumarill, Skarmory, and Espeon. Now, it's important to know that this is a three-on-three -three tournament, so you don't know what your opponent is going to bring. Uh, so we get to see the first Pokemon be Azumarill, which is great because I've got Intigamate on Arcanine. I figure he might switch, uh, knowing that Intigamate is, in effect, hitting uh, Azumarill there, but he stays and hits me with a knockoff and Aqua Jet, which actually does a ton of damage, being at minus one in attack. But that's okay, we go with an exchange speed first, and then we go with a wild charge. He has a Citrus Berry, which is going to come into play. Um, because they go with an extreme speed, and we don't take out a zoomer all there. And of course, um, extreme speed is also priority in addition to Aqua Jet, but since Arcanine is faster than a zoomer all, I will go first. That's how it works. But that's okay, even though we lost our Arcanine, we can go into Dragon Knight. I was really close to picking Dragon Dance, but. At the same time, he might just want to break my multi scale anyway, so we're going to go with another exchange speed. Got a lot of priority on our side. Um, he gets to bring in his second Pokemon. That would be his Skarmory, which sucks because Skarmory is going to be a pain in the butt, in the pit, pain in the butt, this battle. Um, yeah, so he has, um, Taunt here. And that sucks because I can't put him to sleep, nor I cannot use Synthesis. So I'm forced to use only Giga Drain. Um, Sludge Bomb will not work against Steel-type Pokemon like Skarmory. So yes, we're going to have to use only Giga Drain until the taunt wears off. Um, I do question him, though. He is going to switch out after the taunt uh, wears off, uh, and I realized, oh, he probably has Espeon, so, um, he does hit me with another, uh, drill pack here, I'm like, can I please go for synthesis, because, like, I'm losing a lot of HP here, I need, um, Venusaur to hit the Azumarill, um, because it's, it's likely that it has huge power instead of Sap Slipper, so, gotta keep, Venusaur alive. Now we do see, we do see Espeon here. Espeon has the magic bounce ability. Um, if he wanted to KO me with um, Girl Peck, he could have gone for that with his Skarmory, but he switches out, so that's a little unfortunate and a little bit weird in my opinion there, but it's okay. 
we're not going to focus on that. I'm like, you know what, let's go for synthesis. You might just set up with Calm Mind. Um, in addition to having stored power, uh, I can't really switch out because something is going to get KO'd. So I decided, okay, what should I do? Should I put some damage onto this Espeon or switch out? I decided, let's go for the attacking move. However, Sludge Bomb misses the Espeon. Uh, <laughs> it's because uh, I believe he has the item that makes it so you can miss your attacking move at any random point in the match. He has that item, so we don't get any damage off and we get to lose our uh, Venusaur. It's okay, I guess. Uh, yeah, my multi-scale is still in effect, so um, stored power will not KO my Dragonite, but it does a ton of damage. Holy crap. And now we can set up with a Dragon Dance. Here I go with an Outrage, because I know it's going to KO as beyond. And it's really unfortunate that I, I went for that Outrage there, because Azumarill, who is a fairy type, it doesn't affect it, so um, we're going to lose this match because I picked Outrage. I could have gone with a Fire Punch, um, but that's tough to tell, you know, because I don't know if that's beyond would be defensive or whatever. But that was still a fun match. Um, yeah, just going for a Fire Punch instead of Outrage, who knows? But that was a really close match. Hope you guys enjoyed the match. Well, I keep saying match, 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 match. Uh, but anyway, so stay tuned for the next battle um, of the Johto Classic, and I will see you then. All right, have a great day, Chinese.